This is breaking news. In three years, Kim Jae Joon dishes about marriage plans on Star's top recipe at Fun Storant. Did Kim Jae Joon finally reveal his marriage plans? Read on to watch the singer actor on Star's top recipe Fun Storant. Kim Jae Joon has recently dished out his future marriage plans. The actor made a guest appearance on the popular entertainment program Star's Top Recipe Fun Storant. He also introduced his parents, who also filmed the episode, as guests alongside him at their home that the former TVXQ member built for them. In the episode, while he was seated with his parents and discussing his schedule, his mother suddenly asked him when is he getting married. Kim Jae Joon looked immediately flustered, more so as his parents brought up their old conversations about the same topic and pointed out his age. His mother said, You told me that you will get married by 40. When did I? Kim Jae Joon tried to deny at first. However, his mother remained persistent, and his father also joined in mentioning that one of his sisters just had a child. I won't be around much longer. His father brought out the lethal weapon that is bound to make his son speechless. For three years, Kim Jae Joon said that he would like to continue work before starting a family. However, his parents pointed out that apparently, he had been saying three years for a long time. His dad suddenly started narrating all the instances. He said he would get married soon. The singer had excuses ready, but then he was asked to set it in stone this time. However, the fun-filled conflict ended on a good note as his parents ultimately told him not to stress too much, although it's difficult for him not to feel pressured after the conversation. Seems like celebrities also face the same nagging from parents as we all do. Kim Jae Joon is not only a former TEXQ member and a singer, he is also the founder of NKVE Official, an entertainment company. Under his new agency, he recently launched a self-produced girl group, Say My Name Ye. The Septet made their official debut on October 16 with a self-titled EP. Meanwhile, not too long ago, he also made his K-drama comeback with Bad Memory Eraser, which aired its last episode on September 21.